Joy is justice. This is what slow food is. Joy is good food, understanding where our food comes from. To watch a kid pick a raspberry and eat it, and it might be the first time that that child has made contact with the plant, there's a lot of, of great joy when I see that happen. Joy around food brings people together. I don't know, it kind of took my breath away and it made me feel fantastic that you're not working alone. When those that don't have access to food do have access to food, understanding the history of a food type, who made it, how it was preserved, that is joyful. What's injustice is when those stories are not told. On the east end of Long Island, we seek to provide dynamic and lasting change in the food system. We introduce folks to the people, it's the traditions, the soil, the waters that feed us. There's just a lot of people out here that care about how their food is grown, um, they care about their, the health of their local community, and that's benefited us in so many different ways. It's a wonderful way to talk to people, connect with people about this food. I'm always impressed with who I see when I go to the slow food events. It's my friends, it's people I work with, it's the people that I respect in the food and wine industry out here. We're all learning and working together for the common goal as friends and as a unit, and most importantly, as a community. What we do and how we farm is supported by all the organizations and all the people. It, it takes everybody. Slow Food's mission is good, clean, and fair food for all. So it's good for the planet, good for the people. Knowing where your food comes from, knowing what that food takes from the environment before it reaches your body is critically important. Clean for the ecosystems, non-GMOs. We're finding more and more that we need to be in touch with nature. We need to be in touch with our own food source. To be fair, are people getting paid a fair wage? I mean, our mantra is really that everyone should have access to food that's good, clean, and fair. We try to engage as much as we can in the community. Um, I believe food insecurity is a huge issue. So we do work with casts very often. We donate any extra vegetables we have for them. We help them with any kind of fundraising things that they are, are working towards. The partnerships that we have really make a difference because a community thrives when every member is doing well. So having folks come together Organizations like Slow Food, the restaurants, the farms, volunteers to join in when it's our neighbors that are struggling is just heartwarming and a wonderful opportunity to give back and make a difference. Take one. <laughs> we were once called conviviums rather than chapters. And I love the word conviviality because that is sort of a quintessential slow food experience of sitting around a table with perhaps people that you normally wouldn't meet and talk to, but you're on the common ground of flavor and food in a setting of no judgment, just complete joy. One of the things that I'm very passionate about is the products that are on the Ark of Taste. It is an international catalog of heritage foods that are on the verge of extinction, need to be preserved. It could be animals, heritage breeds, and it could be plants. It's about flavor, but it's also about tradition. It's about history. Here we're working with a lot of the local heirloom products, like the Long Island Cheese Pumpkin. Thinking about if we could process some of these for people to make pies and stuff out of this uh, this fall. Did a bunch of jam this year. We were working with the East End Food Institute. I really believe in honoring the process of how food is grown and then distributed back into the community. I'm so happy that there's a kitchen that's so well run that is working directly with farmers. Uh, everyone should be able to access the local bounty and our partnership with Slow Food helps us to make that vision a reality. I think it's really important for kids to get a hands-on interaction with the garden. It, it not only gives them an idea of 
seeing where food comes from because I think there's a lot of kids that have that opportunity to see farms, but they're not really familiar with the process. When you know your farmer, you know where your food's coming from and you're supporting that farmer. Environmentally sustainable, economically sustainable, and socially sustainable. So that's kind of our main outlook on the farm. We're just volunteers here at the Butterfly Effect Project. We do a lot of work in our little garden here, um, growing stuff like tomatoes, we have squash, we have collard greens in the making. I believe that it's very important to get involved and volunteer, especially in the community that you grew up in. The garden brings me joy because we have an opportunity to feed people, to make people aware, to hopefully expand on what Slow Food started. This is what we're so proud of. Not a lot of restaurants anywhere make their own soil. I've seeded it myself. I know when it's going to be productive, and we make it um, a part of our, our slow food life here. That. <laughs> that. 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 Uh. <laughs> Mimi, take four. I love how you like the class. <laughs> it is so It's very good. Okay. So receiving the Snail of Approval Award from Slow Food was really like, oh my gosh, you know, it was a surprise to all of us. Um, but it was a great honor and a realization like, oh, maybe what we're doing does count as some people. Having an organization like Slow Foods that supports us and raises money to give back or to give us a little leg up when we need it, um, it's not always just about the money, it's about knowing that you have the support of your community. I am. I am Slow Food. I am Slow Food. I am Slow Food. Am I supposed to keep going? <laughs> One more time. We all have joy when we eat, but if we don't have the justice behind the food, then we really don't have a just food system. We are Slow Food. So the only true way to experience joy is if that justice comes to the surface. I am slow food. 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 Slow food is about community and about the people and the partnerships that we create.